Live theater can be both thrilling and stressful. So as an actor and a technician, you may have found yourself in many situations where you were under an exciting amount of stress. Performers, athletes, academics, public speakers, just about anyone and everyone has experienced stress at some point. That's why in theater, we do relaxation exercises. You should remember them from earlier this year. When you are relaxed, you perform better. Relaxation exercises are extremely relevant right now, not just to your life in theater, but to what everyone is experiencing. You have probably seen several videos recently about relaxing, how to reduce stress and anxiety, and this goes al right along with all of that. Let's explore. What follows is an example of a guided meditation that I am modeling for you. You're gonna do three things with this example. Number one, you will listen to it and hopefully experience the intended relaxation. Number two, you will respond to a reflection that you will find in the digital packet associated with this. Number three, you will use it as inspiration and a model to create your own recording. Details on this are included in the digital packet. I will now shift from the explanation into the model or example. Okay, so to begin, turn off any notifications on your phones or computers or TVs, anything like alarms, bells, ringers, any external sounds that could possibly disturb this glorious journey of self-care. As well, I want you to find a comfortable space on the floor somewhere where you can just lie down and stretch your hands all the way up and your toes all the way out. You may want to lay a sheet down if you have it or a yoga mat. You may prefer to go outside in the grass of your yard. Again, wherever you feel comfortable and wherever you feel like you will not be disturbed by anyone or anything. You may want to pause the recording right here so that you can get yourself in that comfortable space. Now that you have settled into your space, I want you to think back to the video that you watched on breathing. The deep belly breathing and the long sigh. I want you to practice that now, taking a deep breath in, pulling air all the way in to the depths of your diaphragm as much as you can, filling your belly up, poking it out, and then release. in and release as I continue talking please keep focusing on pulling your air all the way into the depths of your diaphragm filling your belly full and releasing big long streams of air we're going to release all the tension in your body to do so, we're gonna do an exercise where you tighten and stretch all of your muscles as you breathe. It's a tightening and a release, a tightening and a release. So the first thing that you need to do is stretch your arms all the way above your head, stretching your fingertips as long away from your body as you possibly can and do the same with your legs and your toes, stretching both ends to the ends of the earth. Take a deep breath in and breathe. Now, as at the same time as you stretch your arms up and reach your toes far, I want you to tighten the muscles in your calves, tighten your knees, tighten the muscles in your thighs, your abdomen, your glutes, your back muscles, tighten everything, your neck, your head, everything that you can, tighten it real tight and hold. We're gonna go one, Hold your breath, two, three, release. We're gonna do this one more time. Deep breath in. Stretch out with your arms and your toes and tighten your calves. 
your knees, your thighs, your glutes, your belly, your back, your arms, your head, your neck. Hold it all tight and hold your breath. One, two, three, release. Allow your whole body to just relax deeply into the floor. Continue your breathing as I count down from 10. 10, your muscles are becoming loose and heavy. Breathing in and out and in and out. Nine. Notice your attention drifting, your heavy eyes close. Breathing in and out and in and out. Eight. You relax into the comforting darkness. Breathing in and out, in and out. Seven, a tingling feeling of relaxation begins to permeate your whole body. Breathing in and out, breathing in and out. Six, feel your body giving up all tension. Breathing in and out. Breathing in and out. Five, a wave of relaxation flows from the soles of your feet through your ankles, lower legs, hips, abdomen, chest, back, hands, arms, elbows, shoulders, neck, the back of your head, your face, the top of your head, breathing in and out, in and out, four, your entire body Rests heavily where you lie. Three. Your hands sink deeply beside you. Deep into a soft, soothing sand. Two. You can hear the waves up ahead. You can smell the salty ocean spray. The air is warm and moist, and you feel a pleasant, cool breeze. One, you find yourself on a beautiful beach. You gaze toward the water, as bright blue green. The waves are washing onto the sand and receding back towards the ocean. Washing up, flowing back down. Washing up and flowing back down. Breathe with every repeating rhythm of the waves. You stand up and start walking towards the water over fine, hot sand. As you approach the water, you can feel the mist of the ocean on your skin. You walk closer to the waves and sink your toes into the wet firmness of the sand. 
A wave splashes over the sand towards you and touches your toes just before receding. As you step forward, more waves wash over your feet. Feel the cool of the water as it provides relief from the heat. You walk a little further into the clear, clean, salty water. And you can see the white sand under the water. It's pleasant. It's relaxing. It's cool, but it's not cold. As you go out further into the water, you wade up into your waist. As you do, you feel the sense of oneness with the waves as they roll you towards the shore and pull you into the depths and roll you towards the shore and pull you into the depths. You begin to float on top of the waves and you feel as light as sea foam. You're rolling in and rolling out. You roll in and you roll out. You can see all around you all the beautiful waves. The sea foam starts to gather up around you, cushioning your neck, the small of your back, under your knees, your hips, your hands, your head. It begins to float you up, up above the rolling waves into the air. You can see all around you as you are lifted up by this foam into the atmosphere it starts to shape into a cloud, soft yet strong, supportive and firm, but buoyant and effervescent. Notice how the cloud feels. It might be a little bit cool, a little bit moist like fog, like the sea, like the foam it came from and your warm body feels heavy as it sinks into the soft cloud. It's a wonderful feeling. The sky above you is bright, blue, sunny, and inviting. You are warm and comfortable, and the sun's rays are shining down on you peacefully. As you lift higher into the sky, there are other clouds that float by gently, lazily, far above, some below. Relax and luxuriate in this beautiful scene floating on your cloud. As you stretch your arm out, you see that you are so close to another cloud that if you reach out, you might be able to touch it. What would it feel like? Your cloud floats on the wind towards the shore and away from the ocean. From this vantage point, you can see around 360 degrees in all angles. The horizon stretches out in a complete circle around you and in the distance, the hills appear almost blue, slightly hazy. As you drift inland, the grass below gently blows in the wind. From here, it looks like a soft carpet, the wind creating gentle waves in the grass. You gaze down on housetops, country roads, hills. It looks like a patchwork quilt below you. Green grass, golden fields, yellow, brown, blue patches of water, rivers, and lakes. See the clouds around you. See the shadows they make on the ground. 
Can you see the shadow of your cloud? feel so comfortable, so relaxed, floating on this cloud, and you realize you can choose to float wherever you like, in any part of the world you've ever been, or would ever like to go. This cloud will take you there. Where do you go? Maybe you want to float above the mountains drift above the rocky peaks, see the Himalayas, or maybe you stay along the coast, drifting along, watching the waves crash into the shore, or maybe you float through a city, San Francisco, LA, London, Paris, Sydney, high above the city, safe and sound drifting in and out among buildings, watching the people below. You can travel anywhere you wish. You can look down on forests, countrysides, even your own home. Float wherever you wish. Go there now. What do you see? You can land this cloud anywhere you like. It will wait for you. Who do you visit? When you are done with your visit, you jump back into the protective embrace of your cloud and it skyrockets back up into the warm sky in a safe, thrilling ride. You are uplifted with joy up into the glorious white mist. You see something off in the distance, a peak. On top of the peak, you see, is that, you see yourself. You realize this is who you are in your future. It could be your immediate future or your distant future. You see that you have become the exact person you have always wanted to be. As your cloud floats closer, you can see details. Your hair, your face, your clothes. You can see things distinguish the career you chose. What does that look like? As the cloud floats closer, you can see that you are surrounded by your loved ones. Who's there? As your cloud gets closer to your future self, they reach out and they grab your hand. You step off your cloud and onto the peak with them. They take you to the edge and gesture out to the world below. This is your world, our world, in the future. You gaze out, and as you do, you realize you can zoom in on anything you want. Small details, cities all over the world, or just the window of your own home. It is all so much better than you could have ever expected. What sort of things do you see below? Your cloud is behind you and ready for you to get back on. As you turn to leave, your future self tosses you something. You grab it, hold it in your hands. It's a thick, leather-bound map. It says map to your future. When you look back up, your future self has disappeared, but you have the map and you lay back down onto the cloud and float gently away. 
as you drift down toward the ocean, closer and closer, your cloud begins to float above the glistening ocean top and it shines like diamonds. The sun begins to set on the horizon and the world is illuminated with gold. All good omens of luck for your future. As your cloud just begins to reach the top of the waves, it shifts and you sit up on top of it as it shapes itself into this long, solid surfboard. Somehow still soft like a cloud, yet firm enough to stand on. And you stand up, plant your feet on its surface, and ride it all the way into shore. When the cloud hits the shore, it disappears under your feet into wet sea foam, and you find your toes sinking back into the sand. You stroll along the water's edge, free of worries, free of stress, confident in who you are and who you will become. You are absolutely calm. Up ahead, you see the space where you were lying in the sand before. A wonderful imprint of your body. You lay back into it stretch out, relaxing into the warm grains of sand, enjoying the beautiful setting sun, the breeze, the crashing waves. Any worries, anything fearful, any stresses, all of it melts away just like the sea foam melted away. You don't need anything right now. There's nothing to think about, nothing to focus on, nothing to try to do, no effort required at all. You fold up your map into a small square and press it into your heart. It sinks into your chest and becomes part of you. Five, you close your eyes and listen to the sound of the ocean roll onto shore. Four, a wave of relaxation flows from the soles of your feet to your ankles, lower legs, hips, abdomen, chest, back, hands, elbows, shoulders, neck, back of your head, face, and top of your head. Three, wiggle your fingers and toes, feeling your body reawaken. Shrug your shoulders, move your arms and legs, turn your head. Two, Feel the surface beneath you. Hear the sounds around you. Sigh and relax. One, gradually coming back to present, notice your surroundings.
continue to rest for a few moments longer, but open your eyes and look around. See your surroundings. When you are ready, roll your body up to sitting. Chris Krause applesauce. Take a deep breath in and out. Place your right hand on your chest and tap your map three times. Sigh and relax. When you are ready, come to standing and stretch all the way up to the ceiling and then all the way down to your toes. Press the ground with both palms and bent knees. Come to standing. Put your hand over your heart. Tap your map. As you go through your day, when you feel stressed or anxious or worried, tap your map. Remember your cloud. Stay in touch with your bright and beautiful future. Remember, this will all evaporate, just like your cloud, just like the sea foam. Thank you for listening. Listen anytime you need to. This marks the end of the model. Next, you will one, complete the reflection on this guided meditation. Two, learn some wee video techniques to create one yourself. And three, create your own guided meditation performance. Again, thanks for listening. I look forward to hearing your guided meditations.